Come on along. Yep, sometimes I get to use my own tools. Latest nut buster from Snappy. Here's a brute. Got a wheel bearing out. We got 90,000 on this truck. The wheel bearing is out. Yeah, I got the new one in there from Ford. 670 bucks. That's a hell of a thing. That's a hell of a note for a... Come on, Mike. That's a hell of a note for a... a fancy... plow truck to have the front end go out like that. Yay! I'm just gonna work out of Troy's toolbox if you don't mind. Mine's way back over there. I don't know if this is natural. I don't know if it'll work. What do you guys think? It seems to be working. Let's see if I can get a little bit of relief out of that there thing. Easier. Well, whatever. There we go. Good thing we use anti seeds on them, huh? <clears throat> Let's see if I can show you what I'm doing. This is a ratchet, this is a socket, this is a nut, a bolt. And I'm Mike. You guys remember me? I should probably use the metric equivalent or that stick on. I remember when I was 21. years ago. I was going to have Troy do this tomorrow, but I decided against it for some reason. is job one. You want to know how I know the wheel bearing is out? Let me, let me adjust you here. Because it went going down the road. That's no lie. It went I could feel it. I could feel it, man. No matter what you guys think, I still know how to work. Once in a while. The trick is to put this son of a gun somewhere where it ain't gonna get... Bunny 
heavy probably would help. I guess I forgot I forgot to turn the camera back on. But I got the line and the wire all taken off for the sensor. I gotta take the snap ring out of the ah ah axle. Yep, I gotta take the snap ring out of the axle now. If I can get that. What the heck? There's a guy in there. That's famous Amos. Wally Amos. Huh. Troy must have left some cookies in there. Let's see if I can hook her on right here and I'll... This is a high dollar job, you know. Well, there it is. Whoa! Okay. Now I gotta get the bolts. Holy balls, Troy. I think I need a longer walk. I need to work more in the shop, that's what I need to do. I'm gonna go get that longer rat, rat, ratchet. Mind your way. I'm gonna get up inside there, man. Up inside. Some people would say, why don't you go in the truck and s turn the steering wheel? And I'd say, not too busy. She's tight. Maybe somebody ought to grease that thing once in a while too, huh? One down, three to go, right? Hi, how are ya? Yeah, right, good luck with that, Mike. Rust all the way out. I wonder if Troy put any anti-seize on that hub. Oh, that doesn't sound like it. I don't need that no more. Get a good push. the way there of us there.
you go. There you are. This is how guys put their backs out too. Do, 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 do. My name was Doggy Doo. I smell like poo poo. You guys know it's 42 degrees out today in Tigerton. Driving around a couple weeks ago, and I felt something funky. Wow, a week or last snowstorm? I don't know when it was. It's the last snowstorm. Maybe the one before that. And I could feel it in the front end or somewhere. I just felt the vibration. And uh, took it down by my buddy the other day. We put it up on the rack, eh? Get a good look at her well, on the underside. Sure is snoogy. Extraordinary wheel bearing out. That's it, done deal. And we could have chose aftermarket for about 75 bucks left, but less. But a wheel bearing component, I'm just, oh, whatever. Comes complete, studs installed, everything. So the time I save in that dicking around putting studs in the old one or in the Chinese one or whatever you want to call it. Maybe it's a Moog. Who knows? We'll be good. We'll be good, man. Board yet? You're in frame? Yeah, I'm there. How you guys doing today? Been a while. Not that I don't want a video. It's not that I don't want a video. It's just that I got a lot going on, man. Where did you go? Hello, yeah, there you are. Got a lot going on in life. Don't get any easier either. Oh, maybe we can shine the light on the mic. There. You don't get much easier in life sometimes. It just sucks. You just gotta roll with it. Move on. Clean yourself up a little bit in the face. And uh, yeah, we had a turbo go out on the skiffs here the other day. Don't ask me how a turbo goes out, but. About a thousand hours on that engine. But it went out, blowing oil all over the building. So it's been, I don't know, we've been busy working. Bye. I need a hammer. I need a hammer. If I had a hammer, I'd a hammer in the morning. Out of hammer in the evening. There we go, hammer time, hammer time. 
I hope I don't get too much dirt on my camera. Why are you such a son of a son? You'd think I'd know what I'm doing. I ain't never done one of these. No, sir. My buddy down at the gay garage, he told me how to do it, so I'm doing it. What is the hell of a glare off of that head? Yeah, my buddy Matt, he says, oh, it's easy, anybody can do it. And I said, oh yeah, I'm not anybody, I'm somebody. <laughs> there it is. There it is, man. Yeah, see we reseal, ooh. Son of a. More class, more class, more class. Huh, I do need the nuts. Son of a buck. I'm not gonna have these in them. Got a new snap ring. It's amazing. I should have a new seal here. But I don't. I should have, but I don't. Loose wheel. I need that old one. Oh! Oh, man! Put the new o ring on, Mike. Okay. Then we're gonna give her a little grease. A little grease. Get her in there. See we're up. Just on the O wing. Where it goes into the to the to the to the thing there. So she slides very good. Venus slider. Ouch, that hurts. Don't stick them things right on your sack. That doesn't feel good. Hope you guys don't mind me talking like that. Yeah, buddy. Put a little bit on there. Dear Baron.
Put the lot, lot, lot on. Yep. Mm hmm. Here we go. Mm hmm. Wait a minute. Let me get the debris on here. Yeah, that seal is junk in there. But I'm not using the lockouts right at the moment because they didn't work, the automatic lockouts. Because I think we bagged it up last time we were in here. You need a special tool and I don't have it. I can get out and lock it in. Because I can. She's in there, boys and girls. I think Logger Wade should have some of this. It's anti season a cheese whiz container. But still, you can just give yourself a little bit. Yeah, baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, you feel that? No, you're on TV. I'm on TV. Oh, yeah. Oh, baby. wonder how that would work. Never mind. Never mind. Might have to do the other ones while I'm at it, huh? Eh, maybe not. Just up here on the shanky. Talk to yourself while you're working. It's all right as long as you don't answer. Right? Oh, there's a one nut. Uh, there's a two nut. Come on. So I'm guessing in less than an hour I'll have a dissa done here. Pretty slick. We're never doing one before. Oh, that's much better. Can you see me now? Don't fail me now, fingers. Oh, butter, like butter. This is like butter. Not buttocks, butter. I wonder if I should give him the all the way torque. Like wide open, tight. Tight, wide open, huh? 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 Oh baby, you feel that? Feels good. If it feels good, do it. Just not on the wall, man. I don't know what that means. All right. Anti sneezy fingers. Flip it to the on position. I do something error, but it, you can't really get in there while I keep hitting my knee too. Knee too. And defender well. You guys bored yet? I'm gonna upload this whole damn thing. Just because. You guys wanna look at my sexy face all day long. Click, 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 boom! 
I've been working on much on Sundays. I've just been in the house, enjoying myself. Yeah, enjoying myself. I'm working on some new projects, some old projects. Construction equipment coming up. I'll try to get this thing going again. It's just been hard to do. Like I said, life gets in the way. Wow. Oh, yeah. See if we can get this one. Where did you go? Feel her, Mike. She's up in the corner there. Wow, well, there it is. Pretty close, wow. All right, time for the big wrench. Give her some torque, wow. Should I stay or should I go now? That's the wrong way, Mike. By golly. Click. Click. Oop. How'd that happen? That's a lot. I don't know, Mike. How'd you do that? I don't know. Hello, boo -boo. Hey. Click. Wow. Click, click, boom. Sitting here, don't be that lazy ass. Uh, well, get on there. There we go. Give her a couple squirts. Squirt. There we go. What's with that already? <clears throat> have to get the power louver out. Power louver. Power louver. Oh yeah. Back in the saddle again. Don't forget to put that snap ring on, Mike. Okay. Otherwise you'll be pissed off. Slide out there, huh? I think I can see the slot. Uh. 
I thought I could. I think. Uh, show me the way. Uh, well, okay. Now I don't know how I just did that, but I got lucky. Do you hear that? Just to double check. Yep, she's in there. Prefer. I was gonna do this prefer. Well, Mike, why are you leaking all over? Oh well. Let's put just a wee bit on these things here, huh? A wee bit of anti sneeze. Okay. How are we gonna do that with one finger full? How do you do it with two fingers full? Uh oh. Just like that. You give it all of your coveralls. I think she was hanging down, y'all. She was hanging down. Hanging down she was. She was hanging down. Just like that, while we're in there. I like this little ratchet. It's a mini stubby SK number 3866. Medium length sockets. They're not extra short, they're not extra long. They're just right. It fits in between the shock and this spring coil holder, whatever thingy. Makes me happy. Whatever makes Mike happy must be good. He's tired of the shit and stuff yet. Look at that. That's just not right, Mike. Right, let the thing relax. <gasps> Big shooter, we're all on. Oh. Our 
lockout device. Come on here. We want you to lock. Maybe I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, let's get that out. <laughs> See what happens when you forget what the hell you're doing? Just that tri bar in there was making it go, uh, I don't want to go in there. Nope. Hell with you, it said. Hell with you, Mike. It said the hell with you. I'm not going in there. No, sir, no. Come on, fingers. Fingers. Torques. Where's my torques? How you guys doing? Getting on 41 minutes, holy crap. Here I thought I was just a god. I could take care of this thing all an hour. Well. That snap ring might not have made me too happy, but I got her in there. Door in lock, unlock. Auto, as they say. Auto. Not auto, auto. Stay in there. Stay in there. Okay, Mike. Life is good. Life is good in the neighborhood. Come on, hit the hole. There we go. We just started, what? Your hands are not a hammer. Could have fooled me, man. Go back to stubby. Stubby wrench. Tighten her down. You guys ever watch Steve Wallace? He hunkers down. I watch a lot of different weird YouTubers. I never watch myself, but. You know. It's amazing when a guy can sit here for an hour and talk to himself or talk to a camera. But yeah, Steve Wallace, he hunkers down, him and Crazy Neighbor. He's pretty. I think he lives on the left coast of Canada. The left coast. 
Drinks a lot of beer. Hunters down a lot. Get out there straight. Why'd you fall off there, Mike? Oh, don't forget to plug in the sensor. What? Let's get this. I get in here like I said with a rattle gun, but I just can't fit in here with one. That's okay, I'm getting fat and lazy. No, I'm not, I'm not getting fat, I'm getting skinny. But the second part, I'm not going to argue it. There she went. They're all lined up like you should be. Give her the torque down. Downtown Judy Brown. Remember that? You guys are old enough to watch MTV in the early days. Downtown Judy Brown. Yeah, I think I'm gonna ramble on a 45 minute or here. 50 minutes. 50 minutes. Not 60 minutes, 50 minutes. Oh, she's tight, Mike. My force she tight. Because the brake calipers were released all the way. There we go. Make sure she rolls. See that? See that? Damn, that's nice. Mike, you did all right. I did? Yeah, you're not too bad. Let's see if I can do this. Mega trod. Oh, Mike, you dumbass. You forgot to hook your wire up before you put that thing on there. Oh well, I gotta get my camera anyways. Well, here, I'll come down here and lay on the floor like Troy does. You wanna see? Let's see. Let's do this together like we know what we're doing. There's only one way it'll fit. You push it in and you wait for it to go. Click. Did you hear that little click? There. Our wheel sensor's on now. Grease. Grease. Oh, I should I should have greased that link. I'll do that yet. Oh, I wonder how long it's going to take for that one to go out. Look at this piece of crap. I loved it when I first got it, but then I discovered all the rust. But it's been plowing snow for eight. Wait, it's a... Whoop, hang on to your shorts. It is a 2010 after all. What do I expect? I got it from Pata. The, uh... Hang on, I gotta get further away. You can see my chrome dome. When I got it from Pa, it, it uh, you know, it looks all great and shiny, the blue paint, but when you start looking underneath it and the door scratches and uh, it's a plow truck. So at 90,000, you can expect this on the front end. For 10 years old to have 90,000, that's less than 10,000 a year, obviously, unless you don't know your math. Um, he, uh, they always park it in a hot, not hot, but a warm garage. If you get done plowing, pull it in his own garage there, and then that salt starts working when it hits that warm weather mark. 
And there's a reason salt don't work when it's like nine, nine below zero. Or, you know, they use rock salt down to a certain temperature, then they use that liquid crap, and then there's reasons they do that, and it, there's reasons it doesn't work when it's really super cold. That's all I'm going to say about that. So when you park vehicles inside like this, I'm guilty of it too. I pulled my new white Ford in the shop here because I like it warm. Because I'm just that way. You got to wash and wash and wash and wash and wash. Well, I'm just going to about clear this up. I'm going to rattle these things on. And... Wait, let me show you my... Let me get a couple of these rattled up quick. I'm going to do them by hand. This is that, that new snap-on gun. Is, it'll, it'll, it'll snap these studs. Kind of makes you got to do them by hand. Don't believe me? Buy the new gun. It's got three settings on it. And we, uh, we actually, we don't like it for tightening wheels because it, it does do that. It's, it, it gives too much torque on the tightening side. But I should hand tighten them anyways. Okay, I'm gonna rattle one on there. In a minute. In a minute. Un momento, por favor. Me casa, you casa. Oh, I'm gonna have to do a lot of editing. Editing! Do you know editing? You know Thomas Edison? Thomas Edison. See, you got one, two, three. One, two. We'll do that way, and then we'll just let them out here. I'm going to let her down. I'm going to show you my let her down machine. My razor up let her down machine. Yeah. See, we got some metal like that here. Oop, the other one. The other one. This is the let her down machine. You'll see. Because it's got that boss snowplow mount on the front. And that's heavy duty, man. Okay, so I'm gonna finish this up. Clean up my mess, take it for a test drive. You guys be good, be safe. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. See you, bye.